What's up YouTube? This is Ankit, aka The Indian Dream. Today I'm gonna do a quick little video of the new car I got. He is. It's a 2018 Dodge Challenger 392 Scat Pack Shaker. Dang, just saying that makes me feel really cool. But it's in the Destroyer gray color. A uh, big part of the reason I got this color is just so I can tell people I have a car that's Destroyer gray. And uh, just gonna do a little quick walk around. Now this thing has 485 horsepower. I tell everyone 500 because it just sounds cooler. But this one comes with a shaker hood in the front, which was pretty much like the selling point for me. And I saw the other Challengers and they all looked pretty sick as well. But something about you know that just made it stand out. As you can see, there's a Scat Pack logo on the side. It's on both of the sides. And planning on keeping the yellow things on the bottom right there I think it makes it look nice I was thinking about taking it off but I think I'm gonna leave that in there but look at that grill she's mean I decided to name her Diana this is a D for the Dodge so let's take a look on the inside do this quick little walkthrough when yes I wear a lot of gray now just so it matches the car let's hop in the inside of this vehicle so uh, one thing I might change on the wheel is probably put SRT right here instead of the Dodge. This is how this. Oh shucks, not on the fall. The center console. Now, the inside of the car comes with the sunroof, which is pretty awesome. Has the Scat Pack logo on the seats too. I think it looks really cool. Uh, seats are upgraded in the Scat Pack. It comes with upgraded interiors as well as the exhaust this Dodge came with the Sirius XM I use it it's pretty good and yes don't hate me but I got an automatic transmission I had a manual car for four years and I live in LA so those that live here you probably know the pain of switching that in traffic which you know I'm constantly fighting Uh, it's, it's a decent amount of room in the back compared to my last car, which was a Scion FRS release series. Uh, definitely say it's a big upgrade. Uh, especially the gas, you know, you gotta upgrade the gas too. It, this thing costs like 75 bucks to fill up, but hey man, you get the car, you find a way to fill it up. This one, of course, has uh, paddle shifters. Not as fun to drive as a manual transmission, but it's something. It makes it exciting. Shaker logo on there as well. And yes, launch control is available in this car. You have to get a thousand miles before you can do it. So I was trying to do it when I had like 500, thought the car was broken. It's a Alpine sound system in here. All right, not gonna lie, before I got this car, I probably only had like one chest hair, but every time I turn this on, I could swear that one more grows every time. So let's hear the exhaust. After having this for a few weeks it's definitely a fun car to drive can't deny that yeah these seats are very comfortable 
like the material. Uh, it seems like they also <laughs> got pretty good deals for Dodges, so it's another reason I got this car. I think I got a very good payment for, you know, what I wanted and what I got. But yeah, I just wanted to do a quick walk around for you guys. I'll probably upload more videos with this bad boy, the bad girl. And go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. You guys all have a great day.